It's Ali Farah! And his opponent this evening is none other than the Raging Bull, it's Mustafa Assal! Also punishing Ali Farag down that forehand line. And the other, the other weapon, of course, that Asal has that nobody else has is, is he hits so hard from the back. Makes it much harder for Ali Farag to get up on that tee line and, and try to press to get his front court game going. That's lucky, very lucky. But it's... Four love. Already four love. Very impressive start from the young man. Saying about you, I had to do that Instagram live because you were too busy today, Joey. Uh, he was saying that... What didn't want to get you up too upset because you're your big guns. Roy Gingell. It's understandable. I know where he's coming from. The game plan and of Farag just five, two. slowly. I felt that he was starting to paint some of those pictures, but Asal's doing such a good job of just keeping the pace at a moderate tempo. Your free flowing buzzword. Great shot. How's he done? I don't know how he's got that. Ali Farag's movement is a scandal. No lad. Gone the wrong way there. He needed to just track around the left hand side. I think he knew it straight away. Five. Space eight. on the left there. The comeback is on. Those balls are spraying out, Joey. Is it a sign of heaviness from last night? He just can't find the side walls enough. That was much better. And it's been called shot by Farrow. That's a great rally. And Asal finally finding joy in those front corners. Yeah, look at this one too. Takes that out beautifully. I love the way he uses his reach and takes the ball out, stretches out. What a time to break the streak from Ali Farag in his own backyard in a platinum final. Up until this, eight matches without winning the first game. Well, he's done it here in a tie break. Get the feeling Sal might be looking to just go for some quick plays here at the front early on in this game. See if he can pinch a few points like that, picking the pocket of Ali Farag. Two love. Well, this is fantastic play. It's the combination of that classic one-two, but Seven, three. finally on that forehand as well. He's just getting that line going. And Doing a lot of heavy work here. Asal being put under the pump once again. Let. Hand out nine six. Is there a bit of a marginal movement there, Joey? Yeah. 
just slightly lost his footing there. Clever little bit of trickery from Farag. And he's coming back again for the second time. Oh, two good drops in a row. It's unbelievable from Farag. Well, Penn came to Assal, one game Mustafa over. Mustafa Assal manages to hold off Ali Farag. Tight, tight ball down that wall. Very comfortable playing those forehand drops. We've been seeing that, Joey. More and more, he continues to lay that forehand drop in. And a little layup, if you like. All. Well, it's just, I don't know what it is that keeps him in it, Joey. It's just a genuine five. X Factor. Finds ways to to manufacture points with brute force, incredible power. This is going to hurt this rally. That is going to he hurt. He read it. He read it. He wasn't going to get fooled by that one. He held off his movement there, Ali Farag. Waited. Box, please. Just had to bang it down the forehand Seven, wall. Four. Yeah, it's another guess. So you don't see him. You don't see him guess like that if he's in a bit of a tangle. And out. Nine five. Be lapping that up, Ali Farag. Down. Eleven six. Keep the top Farag. of the team Farag four. Leads two games to one. So he just has to walk that thin red line. Another era, four in a row. This is unbelievable in the space of a couple of minutes. You see the disbelief on the in the corner of Mustafa Assal. It's too good. It was loose. Ali Farag's cleaned up so well in that front forehand corner Six, and he knows it one. he knows it yeah it's every point now we're going to see that the fist clench from Seven Farag Johnny one. club gates have officially opened here slight anti-climax And he's, yeah, he's, he's gone. gone, he's gone, Thank so to follow, Ali Farag to one. seals well, ten, the deal, ten, 12, he's won 11, his fourth, six, 11, fourth championship in a row, starting with the British Open, the World Championships, the Manchester Open, and now the Alguna International here by the Red Sea, and he is back at world number one on the Monday rankings. Taking the honours here at the El Guna International. Let's hear it one more time for your El Guna Squash International Champions 2023, Ali Farag and Nurangoha.